we need to test these new dungeons. Let's do it. Maybe even tomorrow. We're gonna create a new character. And we're gonna do this zero to hero run in this new update. You know when this content will be fun and why it will be fun? It will be fun during first uh, weeks. You know why? Because of such newbie players. They will feed you, they will feed others. This fun will be over in one week. Later what? Listen, I will be happy if I will be wrong. But probably I will not. It was a mistake, my friend. Ah, uh, we need to run. Wait, 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 wait. It's what? It's purple. Purple chest. 300k. Okay, not so bad. But, to be fair, uh... He left. There are insane amount of exits around. His hunter foot was almost out of cooldown, by the way. To be fair, amount of fame that we earned? 225k of fame. From tier 6. Uh, it is green chest. Okay. This is interesting, uh, so maybe for fame farming on low tier with some kind of suicide build, it would not be so bad as I thought it would be. Okay, he got also this buff. Are you kidding me?
I'm dumb. One point two. I fought a guy and he suddenly sprints. It is uh, yellow buff man. Yellow buff give you movement speed bonus and attack damage bonus uh, when he drops below 40% of health. The second buff will give you giga and maximum health, something else, useless. And the most useful one uh, is heal. Blue one, yeah? It's better. Okay, let's see what we're gonna get. 200... Okay, listen. Now I can say it's actually good. Guys, it's, it's my moderator. It's Artur. It's epic move. He also got YouTube channel, by the way. You can subscribe. Uh, Tillerion W. <laughs> <laughs> what you will do versus this build? You can't even kite, I know. You and Hunter Hood, Martlock, Assassin Jacket, Single Q spell, Artillery, and E spell that you cannot avoid. Ah, so nice. Yeah, they buff uh, Fire Staff, so use it, abuse it, guys. I cannot use uh, my e spell right now, guys. I see everything. Soon I will. Now I can. Okay. Goodbye. Smash, smash. Oh.
Aham, uh -huh, ok. Nice. Good fight, man. Good fight. It was a good fight. Come to me. Nice. It's not a staper! I thought it's a staper! It is underrated comment. Uh, 600k by the way. Yes! Let's watch it. It is Coco. Playing on that givers. Exclusive content, guys. Okay, nice void. And that's all. He will kite you. Yeah. He need to use E spell uh, immediately. He cannot wait. Okay, he is waiting. Okay, I understood. He is just waiting. More? I want to see my uh, health bar, guys. So if someone will attack me, I will hear that. Oh, ooh, not here, I will see it. Ah, he just kite him for 3 steps. No, 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 no! Mop will kill you! Mop will kill you! Mop will kill you, man! Mop will kill you! Oh my god. This world wants new justice. Valor. Compassion. But this is long past. Now greed, anger, and cruelty have overgrown all else. Whispers from deep within the mists tell of ancient virtues enshrined in stone. Forgotten. Until now. Every shrine cleansed of this wretched corruption. I feel my strength growing. The ancients claim of the guardian on armor. My path. Yet everywhere I look, I see nothing but death. And the few living souls I It's incredible, Coco. They have so much bugs. We're gonna talk about that. We are watching this trailer and I will talk about this update. What I think, everywhere, what is good and what is bad. Nothing.
So, Nightfall. I got very mixed um, feelings about it. So let's start with bugs. First of all, we got lots of bugs in this game. <laughs> not, not in general, but after this update. Actual client, for some reason, is not optimized and my OBS almost crashed. Coco stream was crashed also. He said that uh, this Albion client crashed, his uh, OBS crashed. 5 FPS, uh, for some reason it is uh, destroying your PC. I don't know why. Bad optimization, they need to fix it. When you open the minimap, uh, there is a bug when you press N and your minimap is moving uh, with your mouse, when you're not even uh, clicking on this mouse. Avalonian roads are not working, they're gonna fix it. Uh, there is a visual, visual box in solo dungeons. There is no... Um, and when you open your inventory, it do not show you price of your items. And it is only basic bugs that we figure out as I play in this update. And now let's talk about uh, content itself. Mm. Mists. Mists were changed. And now on this spot, you'll be able to get these tiny chests instead as a final reward for clearing them inside uh, of this mist. Uh, instead of favor. Mm, they suck. They are super bad. You need to be insanely lucky to get some kind of valuable loot. Uh, so, as I understood, the main idea uh, was to encourage players to get 100 some kind of reward after clearing it and uh, make uh, new players, casual players happy uh, at some point and force them, motivate them, not force, motivate them to go inside of this content. Uh, the problem is that this fame uh, rewards suck, and this is the most thing that you're gonna get. If you, as a new player, will go uh, in tier 5 black zone, in thank you for your prime, Xavu, for two months, thank you, man, I really appreciate your support. Uh, so, uh, the thing is, if uh, you are a completely new player, you go in, inside of black zone, in tier 5 location, not near the city, but a bit further, you're gonna get much more fame, silver and your chances of dying probably will be much less than you will farm uh, as a solo player the spots because uh, right now population is too high uh, there is a hype around this update but even before this update your chances on survive uh, would be minimal you would waste your time so why the hell not increase amount of fame books personal tomes um, as a reward you're clearing regular spot, medium. Uh, you're gonna get blue chest and you get 10 uh, books of 10k experience. It is 100k. It's nothing. Uh, especially if you take into account this risk that new player need to take. Double it. I'm not even joking. I'm joking. Double this fame rewards. And maybe it will become um, a content for new players that want to boost their character and they are willing to risk uh, and encounter uh, other gankers. And will try to escape them because believe me, a uh, new player will be more frustrated if you're gonna if he gonna die to um, overgeared 6.3 8.3 solo player, uh, then he will die to group of gankers because if he will die to group of gankers, he can justify it like oh they got lots of people etc. Uh, if I would have would play solo, it would be a different story. Uh, that's why it is hard. I need to overcome this. But he when he go in the mist, he see solo guy boosted as hell. He's a new player. He will be confused and he will leave the game. You need to give value, valuable loot to these players. Increase amount of fame inside of these uh, spots. Because right now, guys, you cannot earn favor anymore. New players will not be able to finish this conqueror's challenge by farming these spots. You either, SBI, it is very important, return back this favor that you was earning by clearing these spots or double um, fame that you can get, maybe even triple fame that you can get on these spots. Uh, it is the first thing that you must do, must. It is number one, because you fucked up. Uh, second, uh, what I like, I like these UI changes. I love them. Some people said that they don't like these new HP bars. Would be nice to have an option to choose the old version and the new version in settings, but probably it will be impossible. Uh, just a thought, because I have some messages in chat. People were saying, I don't like it. 
I would prefer the old one. Probably they will get used to it in one week, but that's not the point. Okay, let's forget about this change. I like it, personally. Uh, UI in general is very awesome. This transparent map is cool. The problem with transparent map, I don't know whose idea it was, but when, let's say, you are staying, staying on the corner of the map, on the, mm, on the bottom, yeah? And you will open this transparent map with a hotkey. That is, by the way, you need to set up before in your settings to use it. Uh, there is no native hotkeys for this. Uh, this minimap transparent will be on top. And it is super confusing. If you will be on the right side, it will be on the left side. So it is automatically moving depending where you stay. It is super annoying. Please fix it. Let players to set up this minimap on one side and that's all. Please do it. Don't uh, rotate it automatically. It is very annoying. Uh, let us let us move it. Let us uh, just set it on one place and that's all. Mm, the good thing about uh, this um, auction house is that you can uh, repair items. It's awesome. It's nice. In general, uh, UI changes in mostly they're nice. I love them. Uh, about these caches that you can find in open world in mists, inside of these mists, this mm, feature I like. Yeah, rewards suck, but let it be. It is random thing that you might find in open world. I don't mind to have them. Yeah, it's good. Bonus, especially for new players who will go in the mist and will roam around. I actually enjoy it. And let's go to the main part. Uh, of this nightfall, these dungeons. Um, again, super mixed feelings. Whew. Number one. If you'll perceive this update as uh, actual huge content update, you will be disappointed. This content, content sucks. Because the way how they introduce it, uh, advertise it, uh, creating so much hype, but in reality, you get nothing. Um, let me explain. If it will be uh, on release, like probably they plan to, uh, add mists plus nightfall these dungeons, at the same time, everything will be good. Because uh, rewards uh, are okayish. They are not super bad, like super useless, and they are not super, super nice. That will motivate players to find these dungeons and will be uh, happy when they're gonna find them. Rewards are okay. Um, first, when I start to, to play inside of these dungeons, I was completely disappointed uh, in loot. I wasn't lucky. But then I played for a longer time. For one hour, two hours, three hours. Uh, I was in several dungeons. And my loot uh, drastically was better, better, better and better. Okay, maybe it's luck, but people in chat also were saying they are farming these dungeons for a long period and they got decent loot. Uh, you can get from a small uh, green chest 150k, which is nice, from tier 6 uh, dungeon. Uh, blue tier 6, uh, 300k, 250k, from a purple half million. It's nice and they are super rare, so you will not be able to spam them like uh, like non-stop. You farm these spots, you activate uh, this shrine, and if you be lucky, you get uh, a chest. No, no, uh, a chest will spawn super rarely. And if you will get them, probably it will be okayish reward. It will not be trash. That's a question. If it is, uh, we have such uh, good rewards only because of um, hype, because of how black market working right now, and will it uh, work in a such way in the future? If it will work in the future, then okay. Keep it, it's fine, it's good. Um, but how are you gonna motivate 8.3 players to go in such dungeons and fight there? I think uh, it lack of some kind of uh, um, points of interest, but not in the loot. What I recommend, I recommend you to add some kind of, uh, let's say, one roaming or two roaming mobs inside of this mist that will drop some kind of unique vanity that you can get only from this mob. Maybe some kind of tokens that you can gather, yeah, get and ex then exchange on some kind of, uh, I don't know, chest piece that will look cool. And this will not affect in-game economy and it will motivate 8.3 players to go there. This content itself is nice, but I got feeling it's not finished. It's not finished. And 
by the way, you will not be able to farm this uh, content on stop. Uh, spawn rate of these dungeons is super rare. Well, how to compare it? How often you get a spider in open world when you're playing mists? With a bit higher chance, probably you're gonna find such dungeons. That's uh, how often you're gonna play inside. And listen, if there will be a wisp, um, let's say legendary, yeah? And you have, would have a choice to finish legendary wisp and go inside of this dungeon, and you are a player, let's say, with 6.2 items, I would think twice. Because I would take probably uh, this wisp and not go inside of these dungeons, because uh, rewards are RNG. Again, the reason why you can find fights right now uh, is only because it is hype. This hype, like it was with Mists. When Mists released, rele was released, people were saying, this is trash content. There is no valuable rewards. When people will understand uh, what kind of content it is, they will stop playing this Mist. The same thing is happening to Nightfall. Literally the same thing. But I do agree that the devs cannot uh, increase uh, loot because black market uh, got limited amount of items that he can it can drop uh, to players. That's why I was um, suggesting to introduce some kind of vanity rewards. That's all they need to do. And then when you will roam in the mists, when you will combine a gathering, when you will combine. Um, uh, killing other players, surviving, clearing these spots, and from time to time getting objectives, and from time to time finding this dungeon, it would be awesome. It would be awesome. But there should be some kind of motivation to go there. So, again, loot inside is not trash and not so good. It's, it is it is okay-ish. Because uh, there was a guy that was saying he got 800-700k from tier 8 uh, dungeon. But how often are you going to find the, this dungeon? And will you be lucky inside? Maybe there will be other 8.3 guys. Fun will be over in one week. So they need to fix it. First of all, a miss uh, outside, like I said, with rewards to motivate new players to go there. And inside, add some kind of bonus uh, rewards that is not, related, that is not um, bounded to black market. And that's all. That's all you need. Huh. And that's my thoughts about Nightfall. Again, it is only first day um, of this update. Only first. I did not test lots of things, lots of builds. Uh, what kind of builds there will be playable, it is hard to say. But again, if you're watching it on YouTube, uh, you probably saw my highlights, uh, my action inside of uh, these dungeons, outside of the mists. I was using battle bracers and they're pretty nice. Um, but again, what kind of meta it will be inside, it's, it's hard to tell right now. Again, thank you for watching. Don't forget to press like button and see ya pretty, pretty soon.